Well, it is International Women's Day on Sunday, and our Lauren Hall learned how the day holds some really special meaning for some influential women on Buffalo's west side. About two thirds of the businesses here inside the West Side Bazaar are owned by female entrepreneurs, many of them refugees from all different countries, and they're getting ready to welcome hundreds of visitors here tomorrow as they celebrate International Women's Day. I used to do macrame when I was a teenager and never get a chance to do it as a business. Nadine Youssef has been a business owner almost ever since she moved to this country. I came here five years ago as a refugee and I start business here after just two months. She sells her macrame on Etsy and here at the West Side Bazaar. You get money for something you enjoy to do it. That's amazing. Nadine is one of 10 female business owners at the Bazaar. With everyone coming from different cultural backgrounds, they all learn from each other. It's so nice to have people like family to support you and believe in you. In honor of International Women's Day, the Bazaar will have special discounts and events on Saturday afternoon. I love to present my culture for uh, Buffalo community. Zalalem Jameda owns one of the restaurants here. She will perform a traditional Ethiopian coffee ceremony for the occasion. So I'm going to present for my customers that culture. The West Side Bazaar is open from 11 until 8 tomorrow with the International Women's Day activities taking place between 1 and 4. You can find the details on WGRZ.com. Reporting on the West Side of Buffalo, Lauren Hall, Channel 2 News.